Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In this one, I will be reviewing a package from Visual VFX, which is the sponsor of today's video. At this moment, they're having a massive discount on their package all in one bundle, which usually it costs around $400, but now it's on sale for just $99, which is a really good price based on that they're having more than 17,000 effect in this package. So let's waste no more time and show you what is inside. Once you have purchased it, you have to download their package, which is separated in four different categories, which are LUTs, transitions, sound effects and light leaks. And in order to get the light leaks, you have to download them from the Google Drive, just by right clicking and selecting download. Once you got all your files, you're gonna have them in zip files and you have to extract them in the same folder, simply by right clicking on them and extracting it here. And now once you got them as a folders, you need to right click, like say for example the transition pack, I'm gonna copy it, then I'm going to C, Program Files, Blackmagic Design, DaVinci Resolve, Fusion, Templates, Edit, and Transitions. And then you can paste them inside the transition. In my case, I already have them. In some cases, the Edit and Transition folder is not there, so you have to create them. And don't worry because they are having a notepad, so if you cannot follow my steps, there are instructions where you need to paste them exactly. And these packages are suitable for Windows and Mac as well. There is an additional instructions for Mac users, so attaching it to DaVinci Resolve is not gonna be a problem. Now when I have the transitions in the correct folder, I need to go to DaVinci Resolve, effects library and open the video transitions. And on the drop down menu, I can see that I'm having thousands of transitions in different kind of categories. On the top side, you can see the folder name and they're having a huge amount of library for transitions, which is my favorite part of that all in one bundle. So now let's preview some of them in each category. The first one is simple camera move and you can preview it by hovering over with the mouse. This one is with a target rotation to the left. So I'm dragging and dropping between my clips. All of them are easy customizable by increasing and decreasing the length. And every each of them is very smooth. So you don't have to worry about any keyframes. And because there's so many, if you want to save some time, you can just hover over them and you can preview them. One of my favorites is this tracking camera move zoom. And I'm gonna tell you why just a bit later. Another good thing about these transitions is that they can be easily adjusted in the inspector. For example, for this one I can adjust the blur level, the shutter blur, I can adjust the zoom pivot position, also the angle, the tile and many more. From the drop down menu on the tile I can change it. Let's say that you wanna wrap it, you can also duplicate it as well as mirror. Also you can deselect the blur, you can select rotation and now I'm having mirror rotation. Let's preview it. And there are really are thousands of transitions where you can adjust everyone based on your liking and what you need. Another great section in the transitions is the transition morphing. I'm gonna make example with this one, which I find this amazing. It is even better if you use some of them sound effects. This is another example for shadow transition. It's called blinking eye. They are also having a transition with split, just like this one. They're also having a stretch transitions. Now I'm gonna show you something in the target transition where I found very handy. So I'm typing target zoom. Then I'm gonna select this one for example. I'm gonna place it in between and you see that I'm having a nice zoom. And in inspector I can highlight the target and I can move the pivot. That way I'm having a full control where this zoom is gonna happen. So I move it to the top left corner and now it's zooming in that direction. Another thing they're having is the sound effects. They can really power up your transitions. For example, I'm going inside, they're having whooshes, so let's take one sound effect. Simply you just need to grab it and drop it inside DaVinci, in your media pool. Then take it and leave it under your transition. In this pack they're also having some cool colorful backgrounds, as well as some light leaks, which are in folders Vol 1 and Vol 2, which you can use as an overlay. So let's take for example one of these, I'm gonna choose this one, I'm gonna leave it in the pool, then I'm taking it and leaving it over my footage, I highlight it, go to the inspector and on composite mode I'm selecting a screen, in this case I'm adding a bit of sunshine on my footage, giving it like a dream look, it's a little bit brighter so I'm gonna reduce the opacity by a tiny bit, this is also gonna help our footage pop off a little bit and make our transitions look even smoother. So this is with and without it. It's a nice way to bring some life in the footage. Now I'm going to video transitions and I'm using one of their glow transitions, leaving it between my footages and this is what I have. A nice and smooth dreamy transition. What we can do to make it better is go to their sound effects, 
pick one of the sounds they are having and leave it under the transition to power up the transition. Now let's talk about how you can attach the LUTs. So you go in the LUTs folder and you're having there also a helping tool how you can install it if you're having any problem. So go in DaVinci in the settings here on the down right, go to the color manager and select open LUT folder. This is gonna find your LUT folder and you need to create a new folder. You can name it as you wish. In my case, I'm naming it all in one. Then you want to go to your LUT folder where you have just downloaded from Visual VFX copy everything inside and then go to this new folder that you have just created and paste it inside and you select update list which is right here and you wait a couple of seconds to update the list and when it's ready you can click on save which is on the right side of this window and once you did all that you can go to your color tab you can select the LUTs which are on your top left then find the folder that you have just created which in my case is named all in one after I select it, I see that I'm having four folders inside with different styles of LUTs. Let's pick the cinematic Hollywood. To apply, just drag and drop it over your footage. You can also preview the LUTs just by hovering with the mouse over them and they will give you a preview of what they're gonna look like if you apply it to your footage. And in this massive package they are having a thousands of effects, which my favorites is the transitions, a huge variety customizable transitions. And about the license, once you buy it, it's very straightforward, on which you can use it unlimited amount of times without having a matter is it a personal work or a freelancer for a commercials. And just like other licenses, you're not allowed to resell these packages. If you want to learn more, just look at their license page. And if you would like to get this pack, you can get in this page, which I leave a link in the description. You can add it to your cart, you can view cart, then press continue, then it will lead you to this page, on which it says that you can pay in four different ways, with card, PayPal, Amazon Pay and wire transfer. And also there is a place for promo code, you can select it. And beside their massive discount, you're gonna have additional $10 discount if you use a promo code MOLIN10 then click on apply and you're ready to go. And for me personally, this is an amazing package and I really think it's worth the price quality ratio because they're having huge variety of transition LUTs, sound effects and background light leaks. So that was my review on Visual VFX package all in one bundle. I'm leaving a link in the description and don't forget to use the code MOLIN10 for $10 discount of the product. I hope this video was useful. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.